about the thing that the enemy satan he doesn't really mind people to believe in god he really wants to keep people from believing in jesus and if he doesn't succeed in helping you if he doesn't succeed in stopping you from believing in jesus he will do his best to stop you from walking in the holy spirit satan doesn't really mind you believing in god interesting part if you look on the map of the world religions today you will be surprised that in the world map of religions today there is not even one percent in the world of proclaimed atheists now in the united states there was one percent of atheists which jumped to five within the last few years but in the world in general Christianity is makes up of some 30 something percent the Islam faith about 20 something percent and then a little bit less but there's not even one percent on the world map of people who do not believe in the existence of a creator every person and every group believes in some kind of a God that therefore Satan's goal is not really to make you believe to make you not believe in God even demons believe and they tremble most of the people in our nation and in our culture actually have another problem they believe in God of their own making they believe in God they themselves have fashioned and created the God that they worship it's the God who's deaf dumb and dead and actually many times it's not a God it's actually a demon behind the God they created a God that they created is a God who permits sin and is completely fine with it. A God that people create in their mind is a God that they create in their own image and likeness and keep creating updates for that God anytime something new happens in a culture. And it's the God that they change instead of the God who's supposed to change them. The God we serve as Christians is not the God we made, it's the God that made us and He changes us. And this God hears us, heals us, leads us, fills us, changes us and transforms our life. Any God you change, you transform, you create a new update and a new upgrade for Him. That God is actually not real but it's a demon behind that kind of God. Many times Israelites, they worshipped God in the form of a cow. And they said, listen nation, this is the God who brought you out of the land of Egypt. But in reality, they were worshipping a demon. Anytime you worship a God that you have created, you're actually worshipping devil himself in disguise satan doesn't mind you worship a god that you create what he really is frightened is for people to know jesus